Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel and part two of the Manchester vlogs. This might be a two-parter, this might be a one-parter, we are not entirely sure. But the plan for today is because we've had two full days, so yesterday being Friday was one of them and then today is Saturday, which is the other full day. Today it is now just almost coming up to five past ten. It is currently dry this morning. Sam's like doing the thing. Here's, just, here's Sam sitting here getting ready. Hey. <laughs> um, so today we're doing shopping. Um, possibly the Friends Cafe in the Primark, which we're going to go back to because we didn't look through all of it and I would like Sam to look at a Jackie E shirt thing that I liked the look of, which I'll show you guys as well. Because the men's section, by the way, was massive. It was huge. Um, it was really big. So there was that. Um, Taco Bell, because it seems that on our city breaks we do shopping and then Taco Bell. That is the plan for that. And then obviously we have our French restaurant tonight. We always do a cultural sort of meal. So in Liverpool, we did Mexican and then we did Greek the last time in Nottingham. So now we're doing French. So there we are. Um, so that's it. So what I'll do now is I'll flip the camera around, show you an outfit of the day, and then we will get going. And hopefully we'll get on a tram for Sam. Yay. Here we are, ready for the day. This is the outfit. Um, it's just a Primark t-shirt. I really like this one. It's kind of like a blushy pink. You've got baby blue and then you've just got the cream here and I love the stripes on it. I've got my sunglasses. I don't think I'm going to need them. I've got my, ooh, where is it? My Pandora on. Might buy a Pandora charm today. I might treat myself. Um, I've just got my River Island jeans on. I've got these and that's a shopper bag on the floor. Um, and let's go and have a look at the weather. So, unfortunately, we haven't had the great weather that the UK's had on Monday and Tuesday and the end of last week, which has been a shame. But as long as it stays dry today, which it looks like it will. Oh God, these windows are so dirty. But yeah, it's dry. It must have rained a bit last night, but yep. So for now, we're gonna get going and we'll see you at the shops. If you've watched our other city trips, you will know that Sam loves so we have made it to the tram stop and we're going to basically go like two stops to get up to the Arndale Centre, which is fine by me. We get to go on the tram and I don't think it'll be crazy busy. There's not many at the stop anyways. Um, so I'll flip the camera around and I'll show you because we are currently at St. Peter's Square. And there's a really pretty building I'm going to show you as well. Here is the tram stop. There's one here and there's one over there. Oh, we're going to have to figure out which one we're at. So this is St. Peter's Square. Buildings, we've got a tram. Some of the buildings are really nice, but I love this building. I love all the detail on the side of it. Look, wow. But yeah, we need to figure out where we're going. It's here. Are you excited? Oh, crikey, we need to go and get it on it now. <laughs> We've made it to the Arndale. Sam is helping me pick bad shirts. At <laughs> no, I think you should get some shorts, darling. Guys, what do you reckon? Matthew shorts? <laughs> I wear shorts, I just go for play. Mm -hmm. Best tops. <laughs> um, oh, what does everyone think of this? Don't worry, I am not planning on buying it, but look at the, just look at it. It's, it's a lot, I think. 30 quid as well. Oh no wait, 15 pounds for the t-shirt. <laughs> yeah. But this is a massive river island. I mean, I come from somewhere where Carlisle's not the biggest um, place to shop, and this is huge. This is just men's. This is big for me. <laughs> Orange. Denim. Oh, put them underneath the denim. It would probably suit somebody, just not me. <laughs> we are currently on the floor in the entertainer. Yes. Looking at what have you got, Sam? Funko Pops. These are Toki Doki ones. I don't know what Toki Doki is. Sort of, it's like a Japanese thing. I, I have like little makeup brushes and stuff from Toki Doki. So I don't know the characters, but apparently they do. I'm gonna flip around and show you because there's some Disney ones and the rest of these Toki Dokis. Some of them are really cute. So with Toki Doki, there's Donatella, Mozzarella, Sandy, and Stellina. Yeah. Yeah. And then up above, you've got obviously Beauty and the Beast, but I own all three. How cute is Princess Tiana like with the... Uh, I don't know if I like the glittery ones though. Wait, look at the... What was it? A frog in the background? Too much frog, man. That's Naveen. Mm -hmm. The prince. 
Oh, they've got him as a second. Yeah. And you've like got that one. Mickey. And then you've got Lightyear turning Zero. red. And then look, obviously my favourite, which I cannot get home, but look at the size of this. 30 quid though. After much looking and searching, we finally found Taco Bell in the food court. So I'll quickly do like a pan round. Uh, so we've got Assam, a KFC, Taco Bell, Yangtze, McDonald's. There's a Subway. And there's a chopstick place. And you've got loads of seating. Sam, would you like to tell us what you <clears throat> have, my dear? Volcano burrito box. So I get fries, I get a burrito, a taco. I've got an extra cheesy roll up because I'm obsessed. And lots of fire sauce, and it also comes with some churros with caramel sauce. Lovely. I have a mess. I got a Crunch Supreme meal, which came with the fries and the drink. And I ordered some nachos with some cheese sauce and I ordered a chicken taco that fell apart and the rest of it is in the bottom of the bag. It's now raining Sam. I know, Taco Bell was really good and we've made it back to the K-pop store because it wasn't very far away. So I'm gonna try and film. So there's like one room that's, what would you call it? Kawaii? Kawaii, I don't know. Yeah. Not the CDs, and then there's another room with the CDs. So. The BT21 stuff, and you guys know what that is. I have no idea what that is. We've got all different characters, we've got some here, like... and then a lot of the plushies over there with the same Plushies on the back wall, and yeah. through that door is where all the CDs are. Um, I'm going to do a little haul of everything I've got. Um, probably when we get back to the room, actually. You're looking at the mirrors, aren't you? Yeah, I just think I want to sit and do my makeup, but my compact is tiny. I wonder if I could open it up and actually have it on the desk. You'd be able to do that. Yeah, yeah. it'd be a bit easier, that was all. It's like Pandora, we both bought something in Pandora. We went in for me and Sam spent more money. Yeah, so... You know. But yeah, lots of cute things. Sam, model a shelf for us. <laughs> model a shelf. <laughs> Sam has no idea what she's looking at, by the way. She's no idea. She calls black pink, pink and black. I'm also going to speak a little bit loud because obviously you don't want copyright and stuff. But um, there's just tons. So all basically round from here all the way around. You've got light sticks. Lots. Whole black pink section. Whole twice. And then on the back wall as well. And the photo cards too. So we've come back to Primark. We're not entirely sure what the plan is, where we're going to go to the cafe, but it's really busy and it's hot in here. I mean, the Central Park one, um, the Friends one. Um, but you've got the men's section, by the way, goes right down and to the right. And then you've got a Disney little plush mountain over there, which is cute. And then kids right the way down. Sorry, that was a little bit fast. Like basically all the way down. Um, Sam, do you want to tell them what you've just experienced with me? <laughs> Three hours in the K-pop shop, <laughs> looking at everything about four times. I would say we were in about 15 minutes tops, <laughs> but Sam actually bought something in the store. <clears throat> a mirror. I bought a CD that you'll see when we get back, and I also bought some peanut butter, mochi. no, peanut mochi. Peanut mochi. 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 So we're going to try that when we get back to the room. Before we leave, and because there's no kids around, I figured I would show you the plush mountain. It's kind of a bit sparse, isn't it, Sam? Oh, this one's so soft. So we've got Thumper. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then Miss Bunny? Yeah, we have Miss Bunny too. Does she look a bit weird? Uh, a bit demented? Yeah. yeah. We've got Moana who looks... She looks all right, bless her. You've got Peppa Pig and stuff. Don't really know about Peppa Pig. Oh, Stitchy. My childhood, I used to love Care Bears. This is my favorite. Never seen Care Bears? Oh my God. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> We've got, obviously, they've got Dalmatian, you've got Angel, you've got Pumba. he looks really weird. Um, trolls. And then this is from Seoul. I think it's 22, and then you've got the dude from Seoul as well. And then I quite like these, the sleeping Mickey and Minnie. <coughs> That's cute. They are cute, and they are only... Sam, help. You don't like them. Ooh, Mickey, 13. And there's the Mickey. 
I don't understand why these have glowing faces though, do you? Does anyone know? I think it's just a feature they just added in. And then this is like Sam's favourite, okay. or one of Sam's favourites. Marie. Marie. Oh, and she is... Okay, I can't see. Ten. T ten's alright. And that's us. We are now back in the room. It is 20 to 3. I think we're going to have a chill for a little bit. I'm not entirely sure what the plan actually is. But I'm going to show you the purchases that I have made. And then we're going to do a taste test. Because you will see something that we bought in the K-pop store. First up, I got these navy joggers in River Island. I had a voucher. And they were 20 quid down from... 33, which I didn't think was too bad. In the K-pop store, I bought, well, I bought Purple Kisses into Violet Thursday when I arrived. And then this is just everything I pulled inside. And I picked up this Twice Fancy You album today. This was 23.80, Purple Kisses was 24.50. Um, this is still sealed, I haven't opened it yet. Um, but I've wanted to add this to my collection for a long time, so I finally managed to grab it. Also in the K-pop store, we got Peanut Mochi, which we are both going to try together on film. We have no idea what it's going to be like, but I will have a drink of water or something next to me, just in case it tastes really bad. And then finally, I treated myself to a Pandora charm. I'll just get this box Okay, I'm making this. Oh, there we go. I don't know if it'll focus or not. Mm. Oh, there we go. So you've got Chip, Bell, Mrs. Potts. And then the other side is... I don't know if you can... Let me try and focus it. Lumiere, The Castle and Coxworth. We have the peanut mochi to try, and it came in sealed packet, and it really smells like peanut butter. I like peanut butter. So it butter. doesn't actually smell that bad. So if we just... Have you ever tried anything like this before? I have not. No, have you? I've tried those little moons. Um... They're quite weighty. Are they? Yeah. Yeah, I had the coconut little moons, and I was underwhelmed after all the hype. I mean, they were fine, but I wasn't like, ooh, these are great. Because I don't actually know what mochi is, or mochi, I don't know what it is. It's Asian. It's so <laughs> squidgy. Yeah, it is. Ooh. It's so squidgy. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. Okay, three, two, two one. one. Mm. Mm -hmm. Um. It's like eating a robot. <laughs> From, you know. Isn't it? <laughs> but this is the inside. Yeah. It's like literal rubber. So the peanut butter's lovely. This does remind me of the little moons. The outside is very, it looked like that, but it was frozen ice cream inside. Oh, I've heard of those. Yeah. It, what is it made of? Like, what is that? Well, if you can read this language. Does anyone know? Comment. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't say. Mm. Mm. Yeah. It reminds me of something, I can't think what. I think we've got the right choice by choosing the mm. peanut butter one. I think that red bean one would have been horrible. I don't know what red bean is. Like, kidney bean? That's a red bean. <laughs> no, it's something like that. It's not, I think it's savoury. Is it? Oh my God. I think so. Okay, I would give this a, for a snack, I'd give it like a five out of 10. I really like the flavor of the peanut butter. I'm not sure of the texture of the outside, the actual thingy. What do I'm you reckon? A four out of 10. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, at least we tried it. Matt's getting a lot better at trying stuff. I'm very really proud of him. I paid for it, so waste of my money. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, yeah, do we recommend no, not at all. Not unless you like, was it mochi? Mochi, mochi. If you yeah. like mochi, then you'd love it, I guess, but it's not, yeah, not the best. Mm -mm. It is just after five past five, and we are both ready to go up, pretty much. Um, I am wearing this outfit you'll have seen um, in the Glasgow vlogs, but this is my 
black and blue checkered uh, shirt from Police. I've got my navy plain t-shirt from Primark. I've got the black jeans again, and of course, the Lacoste. I've got my laptop and notebook and stuff on the floor. I've got my Pandora on as well, and my lovely watch. Sam, would you like to show us what you're wearing? I can show you. Oh, we'll start from the feet down again. Same um, shoes same from last shoes, night. Same shoes, because it's the only ones I have that don't rub me, that are not flip-flops. <laughs> we have the flowery dress. And a pretty dress. This is from In The Style. I think it was Jack Joss's range. Yeah, I think so. I've got quite a few of her dresses. They're quite nice, so... Yeah, there you go. And we're going hair. au natural with the hair. <laughs> yeah, because the hair around the room is not good. So yes, that is our outfits for the evening. We are going out slightly earlier than I thought. Me and Sam had completely different, like, conflicting times in our heads, I think, for what we had, like, when we were going out. But we're going to, I think, Bougie for a drink beforehand. So we're going to go up to that area where the restaurant is. Um, I will try and film in Bougie, of course, if I can. It depends on, obviously, how loud places are as well, I think, inside, especially with music. Um, but I should be able to film in Cote, Cote however you pronounce it. Um... So that is the plan for this evening, and I will take you along with us. So this is not bougie, it was full. And we got told, oh, I'll try later, but I just think it's going to get busier. Unless you maybe struck it at the right time. Yeah, maybe. But we're in Wotherspoons. And this one is called the Moon Under Water. We've had a pint. It's 50 minutes till our reservation. And I've got blue raspberry vodka with lemonade. So we're going to try it on camera, and hopefully it might taste like slush pudding. Probably not. My face is not good. <laughs> it's very, ugh. Kind of tastes like lemonade. I've got like a blue glass of lemonade. Blue lemonade, yay! Anyway, the next time we will not be in a Wotherspoons, we will be in a lovely posh restaurant. So we have arrived into our fancy restaurant. Ooh. Hold on, I'll just pick this up. We are in coat. Sam has cider. I have oh, it's sassy. Here, I'll show it. I have what I think is Prosecco in a really nice glass. We're having a starter and a main course. Um, I'm just going quite basic, but I'm going to bulk it out by adding extras onto it. <laughs> um, and I think I'm going to try the calamari for starter. So obviously I will show you the food when it arrives and hopefully try not to embarrass the people that are around us. Although there's a little bit of a gap. We're not really squished together, so it's not too bad. So, oh, let's try this because I think I ordered the wrong drink. Oh, it's okay. Sam has crab to start. Yes. Yes. And I have calamari. I'm nervous. I'm not going to try it on camera, there is a few people around. I'll just show the food. We'll give it a view once we're finished, I would say. Um, and I've got tartar sauce, which I've never had before. Either. So I've not had either of this before. <laughs> this could be the biggest waste of money ever. Let's find out. After a little bit of a delay because of Sam's potatoes, our food has arrived. I just went really basic. I went for a steak frite, which is basically just really thin steak. I've got the truffle fries, added on a Bernays sauce. Stan's looks a lot posher than mine. It's yeah. a Philly Noir. Philly Noir, yeah. yeah. With um, the lettuce, dolphin noirs, potatoes, and yeah. So we're gonna enjoy, and as I say, we'll give a full review Ooh. while my elbow moves at the very end. We are back in the room, and I am basically packed for tomorrow. It's like, what, 20 past 10 or something? Half 10. Half 10, it's half 10, all packed. Um, so after the meal, which we'll talk about now, um, I got the calamari to start, which I had because I've never had it before. Well, I've not had it in a very long time, and it was okay. The tartar sauce was nice, but Sam tried the calamari, and she said... It was very good. Well done, calamari. It was well cooked. It was done properly. Yeah, so that made me feel a bit better that I wasn't having, like, crappy calamari. Sam's starter was crab, and you really... Yeah, really liked it. It was like crab with avocado... A little um, salad and some little French toasty bread things. For main course, I went really cheap and had the steak frites, which is like a really, really flat steak. But it was cooked really well and it cut pretty decent. I upgraded to truffle fries, had a Bernays sauce. That was really good. Sam got... The... Filet noir. Filet noir. Yeah, it was like some really chunky steak. Really, really well done. It was 
literally cut through them. I've cut through so nice. It, it was just like falling apart. It was perfect. And come with some potatoes, Dawson Noir potatoes, and some um, charred lettuce or charred gem lettuce or something, and a mushroom. Jus. Yeah. So we just had the two courses because we were full after that and Sam doesn't really like desserts and yeah. two courses is enough. You squeeze in the pudding because you feel like you have to, but we just didn't. Um, so overall, would recommend it was yeah. good, but I would stick to a starter that I know that I like the next time. Yeah. Um, as for the bars on the way down, they were so mm -hmm. busy. So on the Thursday, obviously, you'll have seen in part one, if you've watched it, that we did Albert Schloss and Peaky Blinders. The queues were crazy. There was people who were like leaning against the wall looking a wee bit worse for wear than that. And I was like, no way. And there was just queues to get in everywhere. Yeah, I was wondering. It was so busy. So we came back down towards the hotel and ended up in... The Grand Central? It was basically like a rock bar and yeah, I've great. never felt more out of place <laughs> in my life. Um, Sam loved it, of course, but it was so hot in there. Yeah, and it's, the music was quite heavy as well because someone doesn't like rock music, so... <laughs> <laughs> my poor eardrums <laughs> yeah. and then we just came back to the room and that leads us up to this point now we've had some laughs and sorted some stuff out so that is where we are at i don't think we're doing anything else unless we go down to the bar in the hotel for a drink i don't know um sam's letting me but yeah otherwise it will be a uh, good night and see you in the morning and that is it for the Manchester vlogs. I did not film anything on the final day, mainly because we just lay in bed, chatted, got up and left. And that was it. We didn't do anything or go anywhere. Um, just a pain with the trains and stuff at the moment. If you know, you know, they're not great in this country right now. There's cancellations and delays and yeah, it was not good. Um... So that's basically just what we did. We got up, went to the train station, we grabbed a baguette and we went and waited on our trains and that's what we did and we just went home. Um, so I figured I would film this ending right now. Um, I would like to thank Sam, of course, for coming on the trip with me. We always have a blast together. Manchester was really fun, despite the not so great weather. Um, the company was great. Um, loved the hotel as well and I will leave the hotel room tour and review um, in the description box down below as well which is also where the subscribe button is so don't forget to hit it so you can check out lots more content on my channel and of course what's still to come if you have enjoyed the manchester vlogs please do give this video a massive thumbs up and leave a comment down below as well just for the hell of it and i would say that's about it i've been disney matt thank you for watching everyone and i hope to see you all in the next one Mwah. bye